guys, it's Kelsey. So today I'm going to be doing a massive thrift store doll haul. The majority of these dolls are Barbie dolls, but I also have some Monster High dolls and even some Littlest Pet Shop. I have a bunch of Barbie furniture and even a Barbie dream house. So let's just go ahead and get started. Okay, so first up is this Barbie. I think this is from like the 80s, maybe 90s? I don't really know. I haven't looked up any of these dolls yet. But if you guys know, make sure to comment down below. But she has on this really pretty outfit. Um, it's probably the main reason I bought her. Oh my gosh, she even has shoes. So she has molded on leggings and these really pretty blue shoes. So her arms don't bend. But this is a really pretty gorgeous Barbie doll. Her face is in good condition too, and I got her for $3. Next up is what I believe to be a Teresa doll, although I'm not sure. I think her hair is so pretty. It has like two different colors in it. I love her face and makeup, but her dress is really pretty too. It's gold and white. And I don't know, I just thought she was really interesting. I know that I've seen this doll online, I just can't remember who she is. So next up is these two, and they came in one together. So here is Barbie Life in the Dream House. Oh my gosh, I love her. So I think this is the talking Barbie, I'm not quite sure if she works. Oh my gosh. Is this working? Is this working? Oh my gosh, it works! That's so cool! She is in really good condition and came in all her clothes. Her hair is in a ponytail. I can already feel like her hair feels nasty, like gel. So she's gonna need a hair treatment, definitely. And the other one, let's see who this is. I honestly don't know. Okay, girl, you are going to need a hair treatment. Look at this. <laughs> oh my gosh, girl, you need to get to the salon ASAP. So, I'm not quite sure which one this is. She does have a pretty face. I mean, what Barbie doll doesn't have a pretty face, though? Gosh, so she has some purple and gold and even, like, little pink eye shadows. She does kind of feel like a cheapy Barbie, like sometimes you can just tell by the way it feels. I don't know, her face is a little dirty too, but I think I can fix her up. Um, her dress is really kind of big on her too, but she did come with shoes. Uh, okay, and here is the next one. I'm just gonna rip into it. Ah, wardrobe malfunctions. I definitely thought that there were straps on this. Maybe somebody cut them off because it's like falling down, girl. So I'm not quite sure which Barbie this is. It's not a fashionista, but the dress might be from a fashionista. Um, it's really pretty dress, so it's pink cheetah and it has like a black belt. And I really, really like it. Her face is classic Barbie. It's really pretty. And she has articulated legs. Alright, next up is this beach Barbie. So she came with a towel, which is stuck to her pants. <laughs> and her hair is a little messy. I can tell that she's been in the water. So she's definitely going to need a little bit of a makeover. Um, I really like her swimsuit though. That's kind of what made me buy her. But she is really pretty. And next is, I want to say three different things. I want to say Teresa, I want to say PJ, and I want to say Skipper. So she is really pretty. I love her outfit. I don't even know why. It's like three different colors and it's really kind of crazy. So she has orange shoes, yellow pants, and a purple top. And I love her hair and her face. She's really, really pretty. Oh my gosh. Next up are these Barbie and Ken skiing dolls. And yes, there is something funky going on with Ken's head. Okay, that's not what I wanted you to do. Um, let me see if I can pop it on there. 
Oh my gosh, I cannot get it on. So this is Barbie and Ken skiing. There is something funky going on with Ken's head. I've tried to pop it back in, but it just won't go down. I don't know what the dealio is with that. But these two came in crazy bright outfits. Especially Barbie. Hers is like bright. And they have really extremely neon yellow shoes. They're just super crazy and unique. And that's pretty much why I bought them. <laughs> okay, so next up are... <sighs> This is Stacy, and then I believe this is Todd. So Todd is wearing a wedding outfit, like he's a little ring barrier or a groom or something. And then Stacy's in this super bright colored outfit. Totally can tell it's the 90s. And she came with this star pajamas or jumpsuit or something. I don't actually have like any of these. So I thought it was kind of cool. Her hair is in like a little braid. I think it's supposed to be like that. I think somebody did that to her hair. But they're pretty cute. Next up are these three little Chelsea dolls that I got. So one of them is in like a princess outfit. And the other two are Christmas ones. And they are really cute. They both come with Santa hats and Santa outfits and full black boots. And these were a dollar each, which is a really good price to me. And then I got this pack of Barbie clothes. I'm not even sure which ones I got. I pretty much see just anything Barbie and scream and put it in my cart. So we have a white shirt with some hearts on it. I know I've seen this before, but it's really pretty. And then there's this really old looking dress, but I love weird stuff like this. I always can use it. So then there's another old looking dress. It almost looks like an ice skating outfit or something. Then we have a swimsuit. And then it looks like we have pants, frilly bright pink pants with like elastic on the bottom and a shirt to match. And then this really bright pink top. I also found a few Monster High dolls. So I got Halloween 13 Wishes, and I believe she's wearing Gloom Beach Claudine's outfit. And then we have Skull Shores Abby, I almost said Gulia for some reason. And she came with her hat, and I'm pretty sure a complete outfit, shoes included. So that's pretty cool, they're in pretty good condition. I also got this Draculaura doll, she's in very good condition. Um, might have to fix up her hair a little bit, but she came with a complete outfit, all her joints, and even a doll stand, and a hairbrush. I also got a little bag of Littlest Pet Shop. So let's see which ones I got. All of these look like they are the older ones. Oh my gosh, there's so many. <laughs> Whoa. So I got a couple little hamsters or mice. I always liked how they had like one little tooth. I got this cat, a little duck, another cat, this McDonald's LPS, a frog, a lizard, a pig, and I think this is one of the new LPS, another hamster or gerbil, a pink stuffed animal monkey and my absolute favorite reason I bought this is this little brown beagle at least I think it's a beagle I had this one when I was little and she was my absolute favorite so she came with even her little collar I'm so happy to have found this one I think I named her brownie 
So I'm really happy to have her again. Next, I have a ton of Barbie furniture. So I got this Barbie TV and it flips. It's really cute. Oh my gosh, there's Barbie and Ken. So cute. And it's pink. It has like a bunch of different things. So that's really cute. I also got an end table and this couch. I got this waste basket, this chair, and this looks like it's Chelsea sized. Another couch, and it's purple. It also came with two pillows. And then this gold mirror. I got these two Barbie chairs, and I actually already have these, but I can always use more. Oh no, it stops flying at me! I got spoons, a plate, a little cup, a table, an ice cream sundae, another plate, and another cup. And in this bag, it looks like we have another chair, another chair, a pink table, and I actually have this table, but I really could use another one, so that's nice. Oh my gosh, there's so many little things. Another chair, and a buttload of accessories. So it looks like these are some Barbie cookies. We got some pizza, spoons and pie, an orange pot, this metal tray, this little bowl of frozen yogurt, whipped cream, strawberry goodness, nachos. Can this be real? Because I would eat it right now if it was. Blue square plates. I think this is a menu. Has like a little picture of a sandwich. A spatula. Another little goblet cup. Frying pan. A pie. Another little goblet cup. A teapot. And a bunch of silverware, forks, spoons, and knives. So I have this gigantic bag of Barbie furniture on my lap right now. Now this is like the older Barbie furniture. It could even be from a dream house, I'm not sure. It's definitely not from the dream house I got today. But we have another chair. I got this bed. So yeah, you can definitely tell this is older Barbie stuff. I got this little closet armoire. Who dares? Oh great, the mailman's here. I got this little closet. Now, I don't know if this is Barbie. It actually has a G right there, so I'm thinking that it's Gloria. It's pink and white, and it actually opens. It has like this really old backing to it. Here's like some storage. This one is missing its handle, although it might be in the bag. I didn't really check. We got a little dresser type of thing, and it came with the mirror. And then a nightstand, and it's missing the handle. I also have a bin of furniture that is supposed to go with the Barbie dream house. So here is this little armoire dresser. This really old Barbie bed, but there's a hole in it. I That might have just happened. I don't know how that happened. A little mini refrigerator. Another couch. A chair, which is kind of dirty. I need to clean this. And a TV and a boombox. So now I'll show you the very last thing that I got, which is the Barbie Dream House. So here is the Barbie Dream House. This is the 1995 Barbie Dream House, and I got this for $15. So here it is on the inside. I haven't cleaned it out yet, but it pretty much, I think, has everything. There might be a few things missing, but it's really cool. So this is the elevator. I actually haven't tried it out yet. So let me see if it actually works. I don't actually know how to use it. Oh my gosh, things are falling. We're okay, we're okay. That scared me. So the elevator does work. 
Here is the upstairs of the house. And right here is a little wardrobe. So that is the 1995 dream house that I got for $15. There are some like weird dirt stains. So I do have to clean it out and stuff, but it's in pretty good condition. So that is my Barbie Monster High Littlest Pet Shop Thrift Store Haul. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Be sure to comment down below what you found at a thrift store before. I would love to know. I love you guys so much, and as always, I'll see you in my next video. Bye!